Hello, this is XX Menu Ryan from TTJ here and today is just going to be a quick tutorial covering to 1337's Infinite Retail to Retail Mod Menu Maker. So this is just going to be the basics of the menu, how to do the infection part and I'll do a second part of the tutorial how to add the D-bars etc. So what first you want to do is go to www.cod4.codlobbies com and this is his website so what you want to do is add the menus you want the main menu and then after that you want to add all the other menus so you have example example main mods more mods fun menu station menu um, menu, message menu, um, effect menu. So, in the main menu, you want to type in whatever menus you've made. So, you want main mods, more mods. menu message menu and you want in back menu and then in the customs you want to add them so that is main mods so you want to click on main mods and so on more mods phone menu oh that's main mods not main menu message menu and then in fact menu going to save that menu and then in the infect menu this is just the basic part you want to add three options you want to do the show in instructions Ooh. and then you want the part one handler then you want the start infection right and as you can see at the top it will say functions to give handler so you want to highlight all of that copy it and paste it in the handler and then the function to the start the menu is there so you just want to paste that in the start infection save that menu and for the show instructions what you want to do is set scr underscore do underscore notify and then type whatever you want so it'll be move forward to activate part one and then you want to save that menu and I'll put this patch in the description what you need to download to 1337's patch so what you want to do is open that in FFUR and then drag this patch in so once you've got the patch in here what you want to do is go to the second GIC from the top which is it card at LOL you want to highlight all of this and delete everything in there go back to the website you want to load them no you want to generate the menu and in the GSC script you want to highlight all of that copy it go into the FF viewer and paste it all in there and if you want to change all these where it is called lobbies.com etc all you do is go to open properties and it'll have somewhere you can change it it'll say cod lobbies you can change it what to whatever you want so then you save it and then handle editor it's got all this which you can change as well so when you, if you've changed that you can just generate the menu again copy all that again and then paste it all in here that will change all the text etc so just have a mess about with that so yes this has been xx menu ryan with part one of the tutorial and i'll be adding the d bars next so yeah thank you